Meantime, SUNY Brockport is hosting their total eclipse of the port event, hosting hundreds on campus to witness five extra seconds of totality. That's where we find 13 Lamb Stephanie Joseph this midday. We've got the music going, Steph. It looks like a party there. Oh yeah, and the party's just getting started. SUNY Brockport definitely in that eclipse spirit. I mean, take a look around. People already have chairs out, blankets, telescopes set up. So much is happening here. And we're live at the center line where we will be able to see that eclipse, as you mentioned, for five seconds longer. Earlier today, I caught up with some visitors who got a head start on some eclipse festivities at the planetarium. Now, graduate students put together a show that shows the movement of the eclipse up to and beyond totality. They also included history into their shows from eclipses past, present, and future. And the sun isn't the only star people should look out for. The show got dozens excited to see the solar spectacle and then some. They show the entire constellation and all the stars that we should be able to see. Uh, and they gave us an idea of the immensity of the universe. It's something amazing. It's really amazing to see it. I already have my chair down on the center, <laughs> on the line uh, of totality, and um, it's just going to be a once-in-a-lifetime experience, I think. And like I said, there's so much more happening here from food trucks to music that you can hear right now. Even science demonstrations will have the latest for you coming up a bit later in the afternoon. Live here at SUNY Brockport, I'm Stephanie Joseph, 13 Wham News.